Before you start removing the wiper arms, make sure that the wipers are in the park position. Then switch off the ignition and be sure to keep the transmitter key out of range. Please note, the hood must be open for all installation work. To remove the wiper arm from the driver's side, first remove the trim. Loosen and remove the nut. With a pressure piece and an extractor, you can detach the wiper arm from the windscreen wiper system and remove it. Do the same on the passenger side. When installing new wiper arms, you must first switch on the ignition. Please note that the hood must be closed to operate the wipers. Then connect the diagnostic system to the vehicle and control the windscreen wipers. Observe the safety instructions. Control the wiper motor and move it into the upper mounting position. Start with the wiper arm on the driver's side. Place the new wiper on the drive shaft and align it parallel to the A pillar at the specified distance. Then, fasten the wiper arm with the appropriate torque. Using the diagnostic system, you now bring the wiper into the parking position. Moisten the windshield slightly and allow the wiper to move back into the mounting position at the top. After you have raised and lowered the wiper arm, measure the distance to the A-pillar again. Return the wiper arm to the parking position. The wiper on the passenger side is aligned as usual with the marking on the windshield. After installing both wiper arms and the mounting covers, perform a test run. To do this, wet the windshield. Then, carry out a test run with the diagnostic system. Pay attention to the wiper movements. Then you can disconnect the diagnostic system from the vehicle. And this concludes your work.